yo what's up you two we're the october so the thing is is we know a little bit about family guy we're learning a lot about comedy south park is something i definitely never watched growing up so i know for a fact you never watched no it. not at all um i know that we title a lot of stuff like family guy most offensive and all that stuff and some of it's pretty good but south park takes it to a whole new yeah, extreme family. it does we're gonna check out some really offensive stuff so like comment subscribe if you're into the show for sure and let's go let's go toshiba handy book this says it does everything the ipad does at half the price mom do up. not screw me over again if i take that thing to school everyone's gonna think i'm a poverty stricken <laughs> asshole <laughs> eric stop acting like a spoiled brat you can either have the toshiba handy book or you can have nothing at all oh i've got a better idea why don't you go across the street and buy some condoms because we should at least be safe if you're gonna fuck me mom eric you might as well go buy oh some God. cigarettes too because i like to have a smoke after i get good and fucked you want to fuck me mom just say so go ahead here <laughs> huh go ahead mom fuck me fuck me right here in the best bath you want to fuck your son so bad go on mom fuck me fuck me <laughs> you're a boner fighting bastard uncle i just want to take him out okay children let's take what our seat what are they singing what are they saying fuck your son so bad go on mom fuck me fuck me <laughs> you're a boner fighting bastard uncle fuck again Okay, children, let's take our seats. We have a lot to learn today. We sure do, Mr. Hayat. Okay, children, let's start the day with a few new math problems. What is five times two? Come on, children, don't be shy. Just give it your best shot. Yes, Clyde. Twelve. Okay, <laughs> now let's try to get an answer from someone who's not a complete retard. Anyone? I think I know the answer, Mr. Garrison. <laughs> Did you just say the F word? Jew? No, he's talking about fuck. You can't say fuck. Are you sure we didn't watch this one? Yeah, I think we did. Guys, the first one we watched, uh, we thought this was the same one because we've seen both of these clips. But this is actually a completely different video. So there's going to be stuff in this that we haven't seen. So stay with us. Yep. Sorry about that. Jew? No, he's talking about fuck. You can't say fuck in school, you fucking fat ass. Kyle. Why the fuck not? <laughs> Eric. Dude, you just said fuck again. Stanley. Who? Kenny. What's the big deal? It doesn't hurt anybody. Fuck it, fuck, fuck, fuck. How would you like to go see the school counselor? How would you like to suck my balls? <laughs> what did you say? Uh, I I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Actually, what I said was... <laughs> How would you like to suck my balls? That was so premeditated. He's a bad one. So something like this. In the beginning, <laughs> we were all fish, okay? Swimming around in the water. And then one day, a couple of fish had a retard baby. <laughs> and the retard baby was different, so it got to live. So retard fish goes on to make more retard babies. And then one day a retard baby fish crawled out of the ocean with its mutant fish hands. And it had butt sex with a squirrel or something and made this retard frog squirrel. And then that had a retard baby, which was a monkey fish frog. And then this monkey fish They're frog like, yeah. had butt sex with that monkey. And that monkey had a mutant retard baby that screwed another monkey. And that made you. God dang. So there you go. Why the You're the retarded like that, offspring though. of five monkeys having butt sex with a fish squirrel. Congratulations. <laughs> Shit. Butthole. Hey, Wendy. Dumb bitch. Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Titties. Cock. Ginger retard. <laughs> Ass liquor dick face. Dude, you better this watch it. The principal's right enough. over there. <laughs> oh, good morning, Principal Victoria. Shit balls. Good morning, Eric. <laughs> she didn't even care. <laughs> Did Carmen just say shit balls to the principal? You didn't hear? Well, Carmen has some mental disease called Tourette Syndrome or something. Oh. What? He's the luckiest kid in the world. If I could say shitballs to the principal, I'd be mm. so happy. <laughs> Excuse me, everyone. I I guess you might have noticed my awkward tics. Asshole! Pussy asshole! <laughs> I, uh, I just want you to know that I can't control it. That's why he cusses okay, all the time. Eric. We all understand I feel so childish having on this, but guys, this is brand new to me. This is wild. He's faking. Like, I know what South Truth Park is, is that you with know. the power of Jesus Christ, you can be normal. Now, just to make sure you don't slip up while in camp, we assign every camper an accountability buddy. Let's meet Ryan, your accountability buddy. Ryan thought he could never change, but now he's learning that with the power of Christ and prayer, he can have a whole new life. Oh. Uh. Over this way, we have the cafeteria. All the meals are served there. Dumb shit, douchebag! Um. And it means a lot that you're standing here apologizing with your dad and lovely mother. Fat Jew! Jew bitch! <laughs> oh, thank you, Eric. Thank you. 
big nose cake. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think we can all put this behind us now. Thank you. Does he always do that? <laughs> it means a lot I don't know. Here I was about to ask the same thing. Does he have Tourette's in the show? Like, is that something that he just... Because I didn't think he did. I really didn't. But I just thought he cussed a lot. He did, no one yells more than him. He does have a lot of What's his name? Only. Cartman. That's oh, Cartman. is he the main character? Uh, I don't know. I think he's the main character. And then I think... I don't know his name, but I know the one that has the thing on his head. That's Kenny, and he dies a lot. Because I was like, oh, my God, you killed Kenny. Oh. <laughs> the one that I watched, guys, a long time ago was something about Chimp Pokemon. And then there was one about, I don't know, somebody like had to send your kids off because somebody was touching their kids, and they didn't know who it was, so they thought it could have been themselves or something. I don't know. It was weird. Jazzing <laughs> with your dad and lovely mother. Fat Jew! Jew bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, Eric. Thank you. He sounds tight. like Jesse from Breaking Bad. <laughs> well, I think we can all put this behind us now. Piss out my ass! Piss out your ass right on the cow's mom's fat fucking Jew face! Oh, oh, oh goodness, excuse me. Jeez, that was a bad one. <laughs> hey, cow, could I come in for a second? Why? I've been doing a lot of thinking about what you said at Walmart. You're right, cow. I'm fat. That's Kyle Green. All these years you telling me and me saying, no, I'm big boned, or no, that's just muscle. It was always just me living in denial. I'm fucking fat, Cal. <laughs> I'm fucking fat as fucking fuck. <laughs> Are you just gonna stand there? Do something! What the hell do you want me to do? I want you to have some balls and act like you care about me! Heidi, you need to stop being such a bitch! <laughs> Call me a bitch again. Uh -oh. Do it. <laughs> Call me a bitch again. <laughs> you are acting like a bad girlfriend. That's what I thought. Nielsen, oh, oh. Stacy, <laughs> go ahead and send in Eric Cartman. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, Mr. Nielsen is concerned about how you respond to little people. <laughs> oh, did I hurt its little feelings? <laughs> you know, you think you have the power to make me insecure, but your words are actually completely oh, 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 oh. powerless. If we could get like eight of these, we could dress them all up like little beavers, right? And then put them in a pond and see if they build a dam. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> see, no matter what you say, I'm still standing. Barely. <laughs> no matter how you act, I can rise above it. Rise above it. <laughs> oh, he said so your well. fucking mouth. Mr. Nielsen. Oh. <laughs> Why does he get in trouble? He's been cutting the kid. I, 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 was, I was just joking. <laughs> look, look how his face gets all red. He's like a little strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> the digital sports watch is here. Hey, it looks like one of those Ethiopians. What's your name, dude? Marvin. I think he said his name is Marvin. Yeah, Starvin Marvin. Hey, ma'am. Yes, hon? We found an Ethiopian. Can we keep him? Sure, hon. Sweet. You get to eat all you want for only six ninety nine. That's why we all come here on Tuesday night. Except six for Kenny's family, because then six ninety nine is two years income. Oh. <laughs> this is what you eat before you eat to make you more hungry. <laughs> He's like, what the hell? Oh, food's here. That's it for the appetizers. Oh. <laughs> no, starving Marvin. That's my pet pet. This is the time of year you're supposed to share. Oh yeah, you're right. Are you gonna eat all of your peach cobbler? No, you don't want all that. Why don't you share it with me, eh? Just hang around right over here. Let me just He didn't get a bite. Mm -hmm. What is this and Now back to Wheel of Fortune. <laughs> all right, Randy. Congratulations. You know on who he was like, all? guys, I'm so sorry. If y'all ever seen that show, The OC, you know, Sandy the Dad. Bro, he looks like Sandy the Dad from the OC. <laughs> Maybe it is him. You've got some family here watching tonight. Yeah, they're all rooting for me. And I'm sure you have lots of friends watching back home. Yeah. Hi, everybody watching in South Park. That's us. Hey, hey. Hi, Randy. <laughs> hey, Randy. Hey, good luck. Well, let's see if you can't make everyone proud. The category is people who annoy you. As always, we give you the letters R, T, S, L, N. People who annoy you. We just need three more consonants and a vowel. Okay, I'd like a B, an N, and a G. And the vowel? And oh, please. Okay, well, looks like you're gonna get a lot of help here. Category is people who annoy you. Audience, keep quiet, please. <laughs> uh, well, uh. Ten seconds. What is it gonna be? 
Well, I know it, but I don't think I should say it. Five seconds, Mr. Marsh. Uh, all right, I, I'd like to solve the puzzle. Nips. Oh. <laughs> he took that question so wrong, bro. I know. He didn't mean it meant like what is another word for people that yeah. know, you know? <laughs> uh, and he, <laughs> what you saying? He, oh. he was just like, oh. Oh, oh naggers, of course. Naggers. <laughs> right. Uh can we cut to uh can we cut to a <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. I think it's best that when the time comes for the mall to open, you should stay back a bit from the doors. Why? Well, think about it. The first people inside are going to have to take on the brunt of the holiday shoppers from the main entrance. It's best we let Butters and Scott Malkison go first. While they fight, we can simply slip on by. Well, yeah, I guess that makes sense, but Butters and Scott won't be able to get their PS4s. Let's face it, Sir Stan. This is all about you and me getting PlayStations. The rest are simply there to help us get through... He's lying to you! They're just acting like they've given up, but it's a double bluff! Dude! They're gonna betray you at the Red Robin wedding! He got the idea watching Game of Thrones! Dude, <laughs> shut the fuck up! Who is that? He's just this old crazy guy that gets pissed off because I'm in his garden all the time. They're gonna lock you in! He's God in high garden. Shut up! <laughs> he talked about it in my garden to like three other people. They're gonna lock you in the Red Robin and then go get all the Xboxes. That's why he wants you to stay back from the doors. Well, why don't you just tell the whole world everything, huh? Why don't you tell everyone what Prometheus was about while you're at it? <laughs> Did Kyle know about this? Dude, we're not going to betray you. Come on. Did you see Prometheus? We're on the last season of the Game of Thrones about. right Kyle now. Did Kyle know about it. this? Kyle Let's check it out. Stan, dude, hold on. Xbox One is fucking sweet, dude. <laughs> the Red Robin wedding. <laughs> you're a fucking asshole. Fuck you. Get out of my garden. I'll shit in your fucking garden. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys uh the green the green hat is kyle won't forget that again for sure babe what do you think about this i just think they like to use the f word a whole lot <laughs> isn't it almost like shocking as shock value right yeah because i almost think you're not allowed to do stuff like that <laughs> well especially well no nah, man it's crazy like well i mean the thing is it's good to be able to say that maybe it's not like classy or anything for sure for sure but at the end of the day man I guess it's important that if someone chose to say that, that we live in a country where you can't. Yeah, it's just funny. I mean, at the end of the day, it's just funny. At the end of the day, it's, it's so... It's funny because the way that... What's his name? Cartman, he sits there and delivers it, man. He's He really... He really steps into those cuss words, man. He does not hold back at all. Dude, he doesn't care who's there. Bro, <laughs> the principal's man, there. Works. He's going to cuss at her. But honestly, watching these compilations, man, I totally can see growing up in high school looking back which one of these people watched this show you get what i'm trying <laughs> yeah, to say like, there, i can see the influence there was a group the there was a group like that definitely loved south park but bro there's a stereotype i just happened to go everything. like around that group I, I it was never me but i totally see why they liked it so much fun guys thank you so much for hanging out with us like comment subscribe we're gonna be back with more stuff i think we got george carlin coming uh we're reacting we do full comedy specials if you are new here man we don't just react to like family guy and south park and stuff like that we, uh, we did Dave Chappelle. We got a whole Bill Burr special at this point, a whole Dave Chappelle special. And next, I think, is George Carlin. And the list just is going to keep on going. And we just like to check out these comedians from the beginning, man. We try not to check out the most recent stuff. Like, if a comedian's dropped a special, I want to see the very first work that we put out there. Because, you know, it's kind of like a like a story that you sort of need to see unfold in its entirety. So, right. um, George Carlin is next. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you guys on the next video.